Howdy y'all, Riggs here, and I'm here with a big question for you guys. Now, I love my driving simulators, I really do, but one of the things I've been wanting to put on the channel is a uh, bit of a shooter. Now, we got a couple options. Now, I do have Homefront Revolution, right? I also have uh, Far Cry 5, as you can see. I've actually got the whole Far Cry uh, collection except for Primal, so don't even ask me to do that because I didn't like it, which is why I don't have it. I've also got, you know, Red Dead 2 on PS4. However, that's going to take some work to get up on the channel, and there's enough channels that are showing that stuff off right now. So, I was uh, browsing ra random YouTube videos and, and, and game trailers and stuff, and I came across a uh, trailer for a game called Generation Zero, which takes place in 1980s Sweden. And it's kind of a survival game. And it looks pretty fun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it looks pretty fun. So, it, it's kind of like post-apocalyptic meets Terminator, I think, just from what I can see. I'm going to load the trailer in. Kind of about, I don't know, right now. And let y'all take a look at it and tell me what y'all think. I'm also going to put up a poll. So, make sure that you vote because every vote counts in this one. Uh, I'm going to have to get 10 or more votes for a yay. If I can get that, then I will definitely do it. But if I do not get 10 votes within, you know, one week from today. So today would be uh, Saturday, March 9th, I think. Then, yes. So, anyways, here's the trailer. Let me know your thoughts, and I'll see you when it's over. Peggy 16. Welcome to Sweden. It's November 14th, 1989, and you're about to get a closer look at the open world of Generation Zero. In Generation Zero, you play as a young adult returning from an island excursion together with friends. Upon reaching the mainland, you discover the world abandoned with no other people around. Worse yet, you find yourself hunted by a mysterious force of deadly machines. Now you need to find out what has happened, while at the same time trying to stay alive, and eventually wage a guerrilla war against the machine invaders. Generation Zero allows you to create a unique 80s hero and play on your own or together with up to three friends in seamless co-op. You will explore a beautiful but dangerous open world where you constantly need to keep a lookout for enemies roaming while trying to find the equipment to survive and fight. The machines come in many types, sizes, and variations, constantly challenging you in new ways using different weapons and sensory equipment. Wear them down and disable their systems by pinpointing and taking out armor parts and components. Seize the upper hand by utilizing stealth, group tactics, or special equipment to distract or confuse the enemies. Use these in combination with objects in your surroundings to create traps and ambushes and turn a difficult fight into a winnable one. Should things go south, fleeing is a valid tactic. Since the machines are persistently simulated in the world, they will continue roaming if not killed. Whether you locate them minutes, hours, or days later, they will still bear the scars of your last encounter, waiting to finish the job. As you play Generation Zero, you will scour the open world for different weapons and upgrade your favorites with attachments like scopes and silencers. Take down powerful machines without damaging their parts, then scavenge those same components and use them to augment your weapons with high-tech enhancements. This will come in handy when fighting in different conditions. 
The dynamic day-night cycle and weather systems will not only impact your senses, but also the enemies, making for constantly evolving battles. You are free to explore the world at any pace and direction. And if you look closely, the world will tell the story of what has happened. The pieces of the puzzle are there for you to discover and figure out. Just remember that some answers come harder than others. All right, y'all, we're back. Um, so yeah, you just watched the trailer, and for the life of me, I can't remember how most of it went. If you want me to do a trailer breakdown, put it in the comments below. Uh, if you need more information on it, uh, the link for the Steam Workshop, or not Steam Workshop, but the uh, Steam Store link will be down below, as well as the uh, link, link for uh, the uh, website for the game. Uh, yeah. But again, if you want me to do something different, make sure that you're putting it in the comment section. Uh, just what you want to see me get into. Uh, I will actually leave an option in poll for other. Uh, I'll, I'll have a few options in the poll. <coughs> so, I'll leave it up to you guys at this point. Uh, I'd like to shoot something for you guys, but unfortunately, I'm still on that little island. Uh, after uh, starting the new game here on a uh, live stream and uh, One of the things I wouldn't mind doing with Far Cry 5 just to leave it with that is if you guys want me to get into Far Cry 5 uh, Want to get on with a with a buddy and do it tactical so that again will be in the poll And we'll leave it at that so Until I see you guys in another video I'll catch y'all later.